Question number three states, in the figure above, lines L and M are parallel, and lines S and T are also parallel. If angle one equals 35 degrees, then what is the measure of angle two? Now you might remember that from your math classes that opposite exterior angles are congruent to one another and opposite interior angles are congruent to another. And this is gonna help us with this question. So if you look at this region right here, we realize that this angle, let's call this angle number three, will be equal to angle number one because those are opposite interior angles. Likewise, let's call this angle number four will be congruent to angle number three, which is congruent to angle number one. Therefore, angle number four, the one right next to angle number two, would be equal to 35 degrees. Now, if we look at this uh, line right here, we figure out that the whole entire line must equal 180 degrees. So if we subtract 35 degrees from 180, we get the measure of angle two. So 180 minus 35 equals 145, which is answer choice. Thank you.